Shalom Chevre and colleagues. This is Richard Solomon, and this will be a very brief demonstration or tutorial on how to use TeamLab.com. Now, TeamLab.com is designed for businesses, but I'm going to demonstrate how this web tool for collaborative work on projects can be used with students or with faculty in doing a variety of different kinds of teamwork. Now I'm making an assumption that all of you can easily sign up for teamlab.com by clicking here. So what I propose to do is go to my Team Lab account and show you how I can use this with students or with faculty in terms of doing project or teamwork. So here we are on my account and we have four different options that I will explain. This portion deals with projects that your students or members of your faculty are assigned to do. This CRM option is a way of communicating and gathering data with regard to your students or faculty. The documents option provides a means of sharing and saving collaborative work that your students or fellow faculty members are doing. And the community option speaks to other ways of communicating with your students and staff through blogs, photos, bookmarks, booking pages, etc. So let's go and briefly examine these different options available through TeamLab. So I'm clicking on the Projects option, and in particular I want to get to my dashboard. And on the dashboard you see a variety of different activities and projects that are assigned to myself, it's another one assigned to me with a different email address, and one or two for Elaine. It also indicates dates when the projects are due, assignments within each of these projects, and even new projects that either students or teachers will be doing. Okay, so that relates to the projects page. Let's look at the CRM. CRM is really a kind of a data collection and management page. It can list all the names of your students in the class or the names of faculty and the work that they're doing on specific projects and all of your students, if you like, or members of your faculty can have their data listed here and you can also record notes on what they are doing. So that's what the CRM stands for. I think it relates to community relations management program, but it's called CRM. Now the documents page or option is very interesting because what you have here is a way to upload documents from your computer. Okay, so you can upload PowerPoints, upload PDF files, upload movies, etc. by clicking here. What's also interesting is that you can import documents from your Google Docs file and from your Zoho Docs file if you have such files as well. And the last thing I want to show you is the community page which lists uh, CRM information, your users, and other kinds of information. You can place useful blogs 
for the project, engage in forums, identify bookmarks, include photos, polls, and events that are occurring. So, what is Team Lab? And the answer is that Team Lab is basically a project management collaboration web tool in which you can generate projects that your students can do or you can do with faculty. You have a means of identifying their email information and record the work that they're doing. You can share documents and you can share other types of resources for your students or staff, such as blogs, forums, photos, bookmarks, and wikis. Thank you so much. I hope this was helpful.